Jerry, what are you doing over there? I'm, I'm hanging with my girlfriend. That is not a girlfriend, that's a car. You're hanging with a car. How is a car going to get you laid? Oh, no, don't, don't even say that. Oh, God, you are so disturbing. Why would you fuck a car? That's not normal, Jerry. We shouldn't even be talking about this. You're in love with an inanimate object. What is wrong with you? But you have a body pillow. That is not the same thing, Jerry. A body pillow is a substitute. A car is something you drive around inside the car with your hands on the wheels, tend to just like a clock, with your foot on the pedal, driving towards, I don't know, Wall Street or something, trying to get somewhere. You don't... You don't get it, Jerry. You don't get the concept of a car. You don't get the concept of physical objects at all. What are you doing with your life? I want to be someone. Then stop trying to fuck your car. That is not the thing you do with cars. Why are we having this? You know what? Fuck this. We, we are done. I am no longer hanging out with you. Screw you. Have fun in the future. Bye. Hey, can I, can I have a key? No, you can't. Shut up. We're done. And I'm calling 911 because you're sorry ass. Yeah, uh. I'm sorry, what? Oh, yeah, that sounds interesting. Yeah, I was wondering about that. Oh, it's 50% off. Hey, Tom! Ah, oh, shit. I'm gonna call you back. What? Tom, it's past your bedtime, sweetie. Mom, I'm a full-grown adult. I don't need to- You are in my house, Tom. You don't have a job. You don't have an education. You, 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 you're in my house. Therefore, you follow my rules, Tom. Mother, why are you doing this? Because I love you, sweetie. I'm your mother. It stays like this. I wish I was adopted. Well, it's a good thing you're not, Tom. Otherwise, I wouldn't be around to make sure you're a good human being. It's because of me that you function in society. Yeah, because you give me PTSD every single night I try to go to sleep and I see you in my dreams and it makes me vomit. That only shows me how much you care. Which is a lot. Mom, stop ruining my life. I don't love you. Oh, that's just, that's just redundant. Listen, I'm your mother. You're legally obligated to love me. And if you don't love me, you're breaking the law. And if you're breaking the law, I'm gonna have to call you uh, a criminal. And if you're a criminal, you're gonna go to jail. So you better start loving me. Or you're gonna go to jail. All right, Tom? I brought you into this world. I can sure as I'll take you out of it. How does that make any sense? I don't even know my father. Your father was really, really mad. He was so boring, I couldn't stand the sight of him. Why, why do you have to be like your father, Tom? What, why do I have to be like a normal human being compared to you? Why do you have to be lame? I've wanted a life. But now it's gone. All cause of your father. Ah. You're the only thing that reminds me I'm still alive. The only thing that can give me satisfaction is the sweet release of death. Mom, what are you trying to say? I just... Without you, I don't feel like I have a purpose. Yeah, is it okay if I go to my friend's house? Don't leave me, Tom! Mom, 
I'm just going to a friend's house. Your friend is a, is a terrorist. He's trying to take you away from me. Should I take my baby boy? What are you doing? I'm not going to let you leave this house, Tom. I'm your mother. And mothers are supposed to protect the little baby boys from the world. Because the world's cruel. And racist. And Trump's president. So? He's evil and he's orange. Do I look like I care whether or not Trump's the president? You do! I don't. Oh my god. No wonder I was raised by an idiot. Yeah. Till plus two is... 75. Ugh. Fuck this, I'm leaving. Don't leave me, Tom. Don't leave me. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take my belongings once I get back and I'm gonna move out of this house. If you don't mind. Ha! Yeah! Ha! Ha! I'll take that as a, you don't mind, and I can leave forever. Yeah! Ha! Yeah! For those of you who detest cursing in my YouTube videos, I am afraid you have a very severe case of cacologophobia. Which, by definition, is the fear of bad words, or swearing, or cursing. Hmm, yes, this does bring up quite a bit of a problem for us in the YouTube space and industry business, whatever. Because most videos on YouTube have some form of cursing. In particular, the most popular example by definition is PewDiePie, who is the most popular YouTuber and also curses a lot. So, in order to test whether or not you have cacologophobia, I urge you to watch at least one PewDiePie video. One. If you cannot stand the voice of him or his language, and you curl up into a fetal position in the corner of your room with your thumb in your mouth, continually suckling on your thumb while screaming internally, and then, well, I'm afraid you have uh, calculophobia. So, um, yes, that is my diagnosis from a professional, uh, soon-to-be 19-year-old virgin. Thank you, and have a wonderful, not-so-wonderful day. Also, Dragon Ball Evolution's Abomination of Nature, bye.